Greetings, turdlings, and welcome back to Podcastage 2, a.k.a. The Deuce. I was asked a question in the comments of my Lewitt PeerTube review by Robot Mustache. They asked, I'm curious if you have extraneous noise on the microphone output of the Lewitt when the power is off to the power supply. And, if you have a large pop when powering the unit down while still connected to your audio interface. These are issues I'm having with my current LCT840s, and I may consider an exchange for this new mic if these issues have been resolved. Thanks for your time and for the great videos. Robot Mustache, gracias for el comment. And I am going to test this. I know that it mutes the microphone output when you are powering the microphone on, but let's see what happens when we shut it off. And I will keep the recording going so you can hear if there is any extraneous noise while the microphone is powered off. Let's do this. So there you go. No extremely loud pops. There is a little bit of a crackle when I turn the power switch off. And then I heard no extraneous noise. My meter maxes out at minus 60. I didn't see any noise in excess of minus 60. I didn't hear anything in my headphones. So there you go. But let's go ahead and see if I have that issue that you're having with the LCT840. Why not? I have nothing better to do. I think it took about 20 to 22 seconds for the microphone to become powered on and the full signal to make it to the audio interface. So about the same as the peer tube, but the peer tube was actually muted. This one gradually turned on. So it lacks the mute while it is powering on. And let's go ahead and see. What happens when we shut this off? If we get a loud popping and crackling and zinging and all the things that are making you consider exchanging it. So let's see. Oh, I'm going to turn down my headphones. And. And hello, we're back up at about 15 seconds. Yeah, it's not muting it for a set amount of time. It is just allowing the microphone to warm up, the tube to warm up, and then it's putting the signal out as soon as possible, as opposed to the pure tube, which I believe I read in the manual, it mutes it for 20, 30 seconds. Okay, there you go. Hopefully that was helpful. I was just very curious if this was in fact an issue if they resolved it. Okay, bye, boop.